So now that we've created an email list and an autoresponder message, let's get people to sign up to our list by using a landing page. To create a landing page, we'll go up to our Tools menu again, click on Landing Pages, and over to the right, click on the Create Landing Page button. And for this demo, we'll use the ready-made templates. And you can see the selection here. Again, you can use a pre-designed one or a blank template if you want to start more from scratch. And it's also broken down by industry here, so you can sort that way. Let's just scroll down and pick one out here. Uh, this one looks good. Let's use this template here. And again, we're in the Get Response Drag and Drop Editor. So you can add your logo at the top there. And you can click and edit any text you want. So we'll edit this text here. Say, get a free coaching consultation. And we'll change the photo on the left here. We'll click on it. And over on the right, click on Replace. And you can upload new images here. I've already uploaded uh, my photo here, so I'll select that one. And it swaps it out just like that. Here's your sign-up form. We have the name and email fields here. You can customize that if you like. And any of these subsections, again, you can customize those. Change the text if you want. And even these icons up here, you can change. Same thing with the photos here. You can add your own and change the text. I'll leave that for now. So let's click the Continue button up in the right-hand corner. And we'll get our settings page. So we'll select our email list that we want people to be added to here. You also have an opt-in confirmation option. And some cookie settings here. Click on Continue for now. And here we're going to name our landing page. Call it free coaching consultation. And below you can see GetResponse gives you a default URL that will direct you to your landing page. Normally you don't want to use that. You want to use your own uh, website or your own domain name. If you don't have a domain, you can buy one here or you can connect to your own domain if you do have one. For now, I'm just going to click the Publish button. And it takes you into your analytics page. Go back to edit here. And I want to go back to the sign up form portion here. So this is where you want to specify where someone should be directed after they sign up. You can redirect them to your website or you can show a thank you page. That's what I'm going to do here. So click on the publish button. So let's test out our landing page here. We'll click on the URL link. And let's go ahead and sign up here. Use a test name, the email. Click the sign up. And for the demo, I'm using the default thank you page. In your case, you probably want to create a customized thank you. So now if we check our email list here, click on it. And as you can see, the person's been added. And here's a look at the email that they received. It's pretty cool.